Hey, what's going on, guys? We're in one, aka KRDK, coming at you with a my first deck profile of many, hopefully. And today I bring you Lapras GX with Quagsire. Yes, so Lapras GX, extremely powerful, three energy, Blizzard Bird, 160, can't attack. Then you have the all powerful. Ice Beam GX, your opponent's active is now paralyzed, plus does iron damage for 3 energy. 190 is not bad, it's grass, it isn't the worst. And so, how do you, you know, get these lovely water energy, since Max Elixir's no water is standard. You can use, you can just attach them to, let's say, a Quagsire, you know, once you get into the active. You can move on from there on to Lapras GX, and of course you're playing for Aqua Patch, because of course, plus Brooklyn Hill gets all all those out. For Ultra Ball EXP share is very interesting. You're probably back out from damage by attack, you may move one basic water energy from that Pokemon to the Pokemon this is attached to. Not bad, not bad at all. Not bad. So, attach this to another Lapras. Lapras gets knocked out. You know, Pokemon gets knocked out. You can move one of those energies onto it. So, not bad. Obviously, you know, for Guzma, really good, get the key one hit KOs, oh, Tapu Lele GX, be able to search for supporters, Oranguru, you know, Instruct, very good, Professor Kaku, for an extra bit of damage, plenty of damage, plus you get to draw two cards, so you're hitting 180, which isn't a bad number, in the least, so let's... I'm going to go ahead and get, get into a match. I'll see you guys on the flip side. Okay, guys, we are back. I'm going to go ahead and go first. Because it really, you know. And let's go ahead and get. I'm going to go ahead and actually start with Lapras. Up front. So I'm going to actually go first here. Just because, you know, and I'm going to wind up putting Wooper on the bench, you know, get that going, I'm going to put Wooper right there, so it looks like we're playing up against Hoopa, which isn't the worst, so what I'm going to go ahead and do, do that, and I'm just going to, oops, no, no, eh. Okay, this could be an issue. Eh, I mean, it looks like I'm going to have to focus on building a Quagsire, which isn't the worst thing in the world. When, you know, Quagsire got that lovely, got the Hydro Pump, 60 plus 20 more, so with 3, I'm going to be able to knock that thing out. So not the end of the world, you know, put Quagsire on the Wooper, and go ahead and put that there, I'm going to go ahead and instruct for two, come on, oof, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and keep my, I'm gonna actually going to go ahead and grab a Volcanium, because of that. I can't discard, so I'm just going to go and end. He doesn't have another Pokemon, but here's here's where I'm going to get him big time. That switch draft wouldn't have been a bad idea because they're able to attach him, and I'm going to knock out that Hoopa next turn. Uh, that's a bit of an issue. I wish I had picked that instead. Sir, but uh, if he puts anything down on his bench, I'm going to force I'm going to force the hand here. I don't have 
have anything to switch them out with. I mean, if I get a tap of the I can, you know, pull Cracks out with Guzma. Next turn, if I get a switch raft or Guzma, that thing goes bye bye. On, and I'll go into Brooklyn Hill. Come on, Manette Master, give me some good luck here. Lele, yes. I'm looking for a switch wrap. I'm going to go with Cynthia here. Look at first. Actually, you know what? Huh. Look at this. I'm going to go for Guzma here. Or I could have done that before. Oh, you. Oh, you were so lucky. And I didn't realize that was actually a thing. Well, I just. Budged up. Well, <laughs> I messed up. Crap. Well, it's not the end of the world. Again, I can get Quagsire powered up very easily. I mean, I've got the 120. I just need some way of getting around that. Um, this is going to be Brooklyn Hill. Doesn't have anything. Just going to use the shovel. Because at this point, I truly believe he has absolutely nothing in his hand. My opponent has got nothing in his hand. His or her hand. Yeah. And truthfully, I ain't got much either. Because I can't use that. Okay, well, that. I'm just gonna use Brooklyn. Oh, yeah. So I can't use. Because <laughs> they don't have any room on my bench. I did not realize that was a thing. Otherwise, I would have picked Cynthia. I mean, I'm getting, I can, I mean, if I get a switch wrap at this point, switching to Quagsire, I win. So I'm going to do the 120. Okay, now I can use Guzma. Jeez. Well, <laughs> this went from bad to worse. And Eliza. Switch draft. So I'm going to go and just use collect and draw three. Then it looks like it's a shrine deck to use it, which this actually doesn't hurt me as badly as I think. I mean, oop, this guy go down. I could use Tate Mize as a switch next turn. Oh. Yeah, he's going to switch into the. Buzzwall, which means, oof, oh, he can't, so, okay, well, that was a little bit too easy, maybe that game could end a whole lot faster had I not screwed up, so, I win, I'm going to go ahead, let's go and do one more match. And we are back with the second match. Let's hope it goes a little bit more smoothly. He's going to go ahead and go first. I'm going to have to start with a Rangaroo. Yes, I'm going to take the extra card. So it 
looks like it's Garchomp, it Cynthia got deck, which isn't the worst thing in the world. I am hoping, for, yeah, just can go and play Cynthia here. Well, the Bird of the Hill actually kind of helps me out. Here, I've got water. The weird part is, discarding water energies can be the worst idea if I can get an Ultra Ball here, because I do have Aqua Patch. I can, I can almost get the Labra set up. I can almost get Labra set up if I can... I'm going to use Brooklyn Hill here. You know, pull out Lapras, see what I'm working with here. Acrobike! Ultra Ball, yes please. Oh, and... Billy! I want to go Lily here, or Cynthia. You know what? Lily's actually a better first turn card. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I'm getting ahead of myself here. So yeah, didn't go and do that. Now I'll use Wonder Tag. Lily, come on down. Uncle Patch. Uncle Patch. Attacking Energy. Lapras. Lily. Eh, can't use that. Uncle Patch. Aren't the worst thing in the world. I'm gonna go ahead and attach that to that. That to that. That to that. And I'm just gonna end in my turn. Eh, I do have booze my next turn, so. Sitting really good there. He's gonna probably go for probably a Gabite. Oh, which wouldn't be the worst thing in the world here. A Lele. You gotta imagine he's going for Cynthia. Third part is, I've got my energy set up. Probably end up using Brooklyn Hill next turn. The Guzma, which gives me a free shot on that thing. A Looper. A Brooklyn Hill out another. Lampers. Just be on the safe side here. I'm going to go ahead and goose my up that guard now. And... Blizzard burn for the knock. Yeah, he's in trouble. Because here's the thing though, I've got Slick Raft. He's giving me the old GG because He's got nothing. Here's what here's what I am fully capable of doing at this point. Yeah. He's hoping for something. He needs Oof. He's gonna use Ascension to evolve. Weird is it's how oh, that get pull the old double switch here. And I 
could actually pull off the double switch. I could use either switch draft, or I could use. First thing I'm going to go ahead and do is just attach that for the hell of it. Okay. Do I retreat manually? Yeah, I'm actually going to go ahead and retreat manually here. I'm okay with that because I do have aqua patches. And I do have a switch graph. We'll automatically do that. I'm going to go ahead. Well, I'm going to go ahead and bring up the useless lele. Ugh. Maybe I can't. <laughs> oh, I'm going to go ahead and. Play instruct. Oh, God, I accidentally made a blue. Ah. Really bad misplay there. Cynthia. I'll go ahead and play that on that. And I'll just go and play collect. And uh, you can use quick strike. Play you on you. Play that. I'm actually quite happy with. I'm going to go ahead and just use Cynthia here. Oh, what? I'll go and play Echo Bite. Yeah. I'll go figure. Um, I'm going to go figure. I'll go and retreat. Bring up that. Let me just throw these two. And I'll go ahead and blow the burn for one. 90. Oh, yeah, that's right. Cynthia, motherfucker. Quack Sire, come on down. I'm excited. Really probably gonna catch the play light, but eh, it is what it is. Can I even attack? No, I can't even attack. Eh. Oh, that would be hilarious, and I could totally do it. <laughs> I could use washout. Or yeah, I can do that up. Oh, never mind. Well, I can't play any more supporters. I can't even attack. I'm going to go ahead and there. I mean, I'm giving him possible out, but it's not looking good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think if he gets another, oh, he, he already played Lily. Um, 
Maybe I'll go ahead and put it right for the now. This deck is ridiculously powerful. Like we are talking ridiculously. He's just gonna go ahead and retreat. This is pretty much a lost game on him. Like you said, he's pretty much lost. I'm gonna end it. I can use Guzma up, Guzma up. Why can't I even see Lucario sitting at one thing? Yeah, I hope he's gonna go ahead and do something like that. Go ahead and do that with Quagtire. Get draft. Put into that. Another burn for the now. Not all is lost, however. I mean, all I've got to do is take one prize. And... In theory, because I believe this is the one that's got the... No, it's got the voice band on it. What am I if you actually use it? Well, because I'm going to activate and lie the... I mean, here's the deal, though. Yeah, he's going to go ahead and do that. He's probably going to take me out. Which, yeah, you know, there goes the EXP here. Hmm. You know what? Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that. No. Hundred and twenty to the bench. Uh, yeah, I'm actually gonna pick Lapras here. Back for turn. Wash out. Quagsire onto Lapras. I'm gonna go ahead and wash out from Tapu Lele onto Lapras. And I'm going to go ahead and buzzer burn for the knock. I'm going to go ahead and give my opponent a G freaking G. This was <laughs> bad misplay on his end. Tonight. I'll see you guys, I'll see you guys back on the deck screen for a quick wrap up. So, so, we've done two matches. So, what do I think of the deck? It's great. Obviously, I'm going to, you know, I'm going to tweak some things. I just, there's some things I don't particularly care for. Like the Switch Raft, I'd probably switch one of those out just for a regular Switch. The Switch Raft is a great card, and I love it because it deals damage. But the issue is when you get Happy Lele or Orange Guru stuck, can't really manipulate that Quagsire. No, we didn't get a chance to use it. It's a ridiculously solid card all around. Not only because of its ability to, you know, move water energies from your bank to your active, which is extremely good, but its attack, Hydro Pump, isn't bad. You've got three water energies, which is all the energy you run. You're getting 120. 150 with a choice band, and I get it, 120's not going to hit a whole lot of Pokemon, but you can easily manipulate things around. The EXP shares, I'm probably going to swap those out for Wishful Baton. You know, a, I just genuinely think it's a better, Wishful Baton's a better card, and, but 
Kids Beach here was pretty worth it. Um, Kukui never really had a chance to use it. The extra point of damage isn't terrible. And I mean, 130 is going to be a big number you want to hit, so I can, you know, I'm okay with that. Part of the hills are lifesavers, especially against Shrine decks. Luckily, you didn't run into one. But as you can see, this deck is all around very powerful. Lapras GX are really good cards. Even if the regular attack at Collect is a really good attack to use. So yeah, let me let me know what you guys think in the comments. Make sure you follow me on Twitter at Forever 91 Stay tuned for more Pokemon content. I am the Forever Ranger. You guys take care and always remember, gotta catch them all.